Hello everyone and welcome back to Persona 3 Reload. Last time we explored the first floor of Tartarus and got a taste of Reload's combat. And now uh, Meat Series telling us to leave, which is honestly a shame because I had a lot of fun, but all good things must come Not to an bad. end. Excellent work. I have high hopes for our future expeditions. The dark hour will be ending soon. Yeah, I guess they're just gonna say tower you know, shuffles things around. I do wonder if we went back to the first floor, it would stay the same, but yeah. Salut. Let's get out of, what'd you just call me? Let's finish up here. Does that sound good to you? I guess. All right, rest up and come prepared for our next expedition. And thus we have the feedback loop of P3 Reload. Do well in school, in your normal life, to assist yourself in the tower, believe it or not. Hey, you're in 2F, right? I, I might be. What's with the weary look in your eye? I'm Kenji Tomachika. We're in the same class. We are? I don't, I didn't, dude, I've been out of school a while. I don't have the homework. What do you want from me? Sorry. <laughs> Nothing really. Just thought I'd say hi. I heard from Iori that you're pretty close to Takeba-san. Uh, is that true? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Looking for someone with a little more experience anyway. I guess she is only level two. Ah, crap, it's almost time for morning. Come on, better hurry. Okay, it <laughs> just shows up and... That concludes the main portion of today's assembly. Talks about his dating preferences. Huh? Next, we'll hear a word from the student council. Please welcome the new president, Mitsuru Kirijo, from Class 3D. Thank you. So she did get elected. Well, I guess she is the most popular girl in school. You can say that again. She's got this intimidating vibe around her. Not to mention, this school's owned by the Carijo Group, right? As I begin my term as student council president, I'd like to share with you my vision for this coming year. It is my firm belief that each of us must accept the responsibility of bettering our school. However, change cannot occur without sustained effort and an unprecedented level of commitment. That is why we must restructure our daily lives in order to rise to this challenge. I'd like each of you to dig deeply into your well of motivation and reevaluate your convictions. Strive to imagine a bold new future without losing sight of the realities around you. That is the key. My own ideas are but one person's vision. For us to reap the full benefits of our education, your participation, opinions, and enthusiasm are essential. Thank you. Dang, what a speech. Yeah, she really got the crowd going crazy. I mean, look at him. Do you uh, have any idea what she just said? Uh, you know, it's just an error crap. Do your best, don't lose vision. Uh, the key, the school, you know, not really. Me neither. <laughs> We live in the same dorm, but it's like we're on different planets. Man, if she asks for my opinion, I don't know what I'll say. Let's just hope it doesn't come to that. But I, yeah, I don't know. It's just I guess that's what you have to do when you're elected president. Okay, time for class. Maybe us as a population just love speeches. All right, today we'll be looking at some Meiji era literature. Open your textbooks to page 12. You know what? I'm sick of this story. I already went over this in the last class. Oh my god. We're going off the rails. I got a great poem we can discuss instead. Close your textbooks, everyone, and listen to this. Isolated cloud. Suspended over the tall, snowy mountain peak. I feel sleepy. But I'm not going to risk it today. After thinking about long and hard, academics is like a pain in the butt to level. Usually. I want to keep in mind... Some of my old knowledge from the previous version might not apply, but, you know, what even? I'm kind of role-playing. Wait, she just said, what even? That is so tough. Kenji, you better not be sleeping back there. You should be ashamed of yourself napping while I pour my heart into this reading. You're getting another essay on top of the regular assignment tonight. I expect a slice of cake when you turn it in, too. And don't cheap out with the store-bought stuff. Like last time. Oh, God. That was negative attention from an older woman. Kenji's having a field day. I forced myself to stay awake and listen to the incredibly boring lecture. Rika. One point of academics. Like, yeah, there's only three stats in this one, so I guess they're going to take a lot longer than usual to 
work towards. I really thought about that. I'd prefer that than introducing a whole other stat and messing everything up. Oh god, I sound like such a nerd. Yo, wanna stop by Paulonia Mall on the way back? That's how you say it? Might wanna stock up while we can, since we got stuff going on at night. On what? There's a pharmacy there too. Oh. Couldn't hurt to get some meds in case anything happens. I thought you were talking about Crane Game again. It's like, bro, we came back empty handed. What do you mean stock up? But yeah, yeah, we'll we'll do it, but you seem pretty pumped. Like about shopping? Uh, you bet I am. <laughs> if we don't step up to the plate, who will? The chairman said it himself. The fate of the world depends on us. Let's go, leader. First task, escape from the school. Oh, God. However we manage. But, yeah, I guess we don't have a free day. Uh, it's the Madison, that's not my name. I wonder if you could name yourself that. Oh. Wait for us. Uh, I guess he's popular. You noticed how popular Sonata-san is with the ladies? Man, take a look at that. I know, right? They're in a triangle attack formation. There's no way you can defend against that. I guess neither of us really got to know him before all this crazy stuff happened. He's a captain of the boxing team. Never lost a single match. I know that's cool and all, but... That is an unbelievable record. I mean, maybe his persona helps him out, but even still, never... Who'd have thought boxing would turn you into a chick man? I mean, come on! They're fawning on him more than a harem monk. I wonder where they're going. Hey, are you guys free this afternoon? Huh? Uh, us? Yeah, I mean, hell yeah! We love to join your little, uh, group here. Oh. What about the pharmacy, <laughs> Junpei? <laughs> Come on. We can shop later. I mean, yeah, the ibuprofen's not going anywhere, but... Well, are you free or not? Yeah, of course. No problemo. I want the two of you to meet me at Polonia Mall. You know where it is, right? I'll be waiting at the police station. Got it? The, the police station? You mean, we're not hanging out with your friends? Who? These girls? No, I don't even know their names. Oh. Hearing so much chit chat gives me a headache. God, Akihiko, let them down easy. Anyway, I'm going on ahead. Don't keep me waiting. Oh, I think I bet they like the negative attention though. Oh, he's so mean to me, but he's playing hard to get. Oh yeah. Anyway, police station. Senpai, don't leave us. I. Jeez, that does seem annoying. Yeah. How can he not know their names? I mean, seriously, just look at them. Uh, anyway, let's go. Yeah, yeah. Remember, meets through speech, Yunpei. Eyes on the prize. Sonata asked us to meet him at the Polonia Mall police station. I know I was saying it right. Junpei just called it Polonia yeah. Mall. Threw me off. Well, I'll just head there myself. You know the place, right? Let's go! But before that, must talk to every random NPC. Huh. I'm waiting for my boyfriend. I have a boyfriend, by the way. He's on his way. I have a boyfriend. You should leave. I. <laughs> We're going to Hagakure. Well, I hope you have fun. Anyway. Oh, what? What is it? Oh, man. This looks like it leaves the Arboretum. Maybe not. Maybe that opens up later. You know what? Every school is at least one mystery that no one can solve. There's one here, too, you know. Like the sculpture in the art room that moves by itself. It's not a cooler in my mind. Maybe it's an optical illusion. You just got trolled. You know possibility <sighs> oh the fawning student <laughs> i get it i get it but it seems like akiko's got a lot on his mind just saying i have this strange feeling that someone's watching me maybe it's just my imagination Ugh. it's a little bit of uh i don't know what's going on inside the school high school always a lot of issues but yeah let's head over and see what we got oh, ever so lively and the, oh, that store's not open yet. But the police station is not a store. I see Akihiko, dang, these graphics. I know that sounds silly, because it's not like it's like crazy HD, but I don't know. They're doing a lot. Oh, man. So this is, you know, one thing did change for sure, and that's the new floor. Like, it's not all like shiny. It's not a bad thing or a good thing. It's just a thing, but yeah, let's, uh, you know, get right to it. 
That's what Sonata was talking about, right? Oh, wait, I see him right in there. Let's go. It's a little cramped in here. Okay, no, it is way bigger on the inside. <laughs> Thank you, Kurosawa-san. I'll be taking it. Oh, these are the guys I was talking about earlier. <sighs> this is Officer Kurosawa. He helps keep our squad well equipped. Oh, and here. This is from Mikutsuki san. Yo, a stipend? Eh? Whoa, is that our war funds? You shouldn't have. You can't fight empty handed, so find something you like. Kurosawa san has connections. He can secure equipment for us, but these things still cost money. Of course they do. Nothing in life is free. I realize that. Well, I'll see you later. Thanks again. And he's gone like that. I've been informed about you two. Oh, you have? My job is to maintain peace in the city regardless of the circumstances. I'm just an ordinary police officer, but it doesn't take a genius to know something strange is going on here. I'm only doing what I think is right. Nothing more. If you need something, we can talk in the back. In the back? Alright. Oh. Now then. I don't have that much. We should be able to find what you need. Alright, so this is where we get our gear. Some of it anyways. Some of it I assume can also get inside the tower, but you know, when you're done with gear, you can also sell it. And for the most part, in Persona, most gear becomes obsolete once you find the next thing. It's not really, there's not a lot of decision making to do. But for the most part, uh in this version. We can get footwear, which increases our... Oh, it doesn't actually increase our dodge chance. Okay, this one just has strength on it. Not bad, not bad. But yeah, for the most part, I'm probably just going to prioritize, you know, defense for everybody. That's usually how it goes. And I do not as much money as I thought I would. Ooh. We can't afford anything else. E. Hopefully Junpei is, you know, taking care of himself. I thought we'd be able to purchase more, but no, we need some stuff for the pharmacy. You want to buy anything, you know where to find me. Drop by anytime. Unless I'm solving a crime, then I'm not here. That's fair. Hey, that was brief. I can't believe the police station's selling weapons. What's more? They only gave us 5,000 yen. I know! Ain't that kind of stingy? I mean, kind of saving the world. I know, right? I was thinking the same thing. I like how in sync I'm with Junpei. Oh, crap, it's this late already? I'm gonna miss the rerun of the Lonely Shogun. Uh, I gotta go. Uh, I... I? Later, but... Yet again, I guess the ibuprofen's not going anywhere. <laughs> wow, well, about that. I'll leave the rest to you, leader. Let's meet up again. You know where. I don't know where. Oh, the tower. There's a yeah. ton of shops and stuff in this place, so... You really should check it out while you can. All right, see you back at the dorm. Don't mind if I do. Okay, we're finally off our leash and we can go crazy. So after school activities, starting day, you're free to- Yes! Yes, I'm literally free! Make sure you boost your stats. I cannot even stress enough how important these are because some social links, which we only have one right now, are locked behind this and debatably the coolest and best ones. And also I think like, you know, with Toriyumi, right? She's like, oh, what's your first name? You couldn't ask that without you know, extreme courage. So we're going to be doing that a whole heck of a lot. Network function. I don't need that crap out of my way. I'm trying to buy some drugs at the legal location for that. The pharmacy. Welcome. Competition between pharmacies is heating up. Got to make my store more unique or I'll be sunk. Start by making Saturday regular sale days. Come out this weekend and support my store. I like that. That is cool. Was that always the case? I don't know, but yeah, I guess do your shopping on Saturdays, just like in real life. Cool. But I don't want to spend too much early on because pretty much moving forward, money is going to be kind of tight until we get back to Tartarus. So let's get two of these. They're probably going to be necessary for like the coming battles. And uh, yeah, nothing else really looks good here. Oh, wait. What did I buy? Did I buy medicine or did I buy medicinal powder? Oh god. I hope I didn't spend 1400 Anyway, let's go. We should have probably waited till Saturday, but, you know. It's his fault! I was already here. Ah, let's anyway. What's up, dude? Are you here for the arcade? If you want to know about the games, I can tell you about them. Dude, I'd love that. Let's talk. 
Today we're going to play either House of the Deceased or Real Wafer. House of the Deceased is pretty scary. Increase your courage. The racer requires nimble fingers, so increases your agility. Oh, okay. It's pretty cool. He has like a forecast. I doubt we can afford this. Well, let's just check. Various arcade games are inside, so yeah. Just increases your three primary stats depending on the game. Yeah, I'll get it, so. Oh my god. Three! 3,000 yen! How many times are you playing House of the Deceased, Makoto? That is like $30. No, wait, it's even... No, it's less or more because of... I... Ah, oh, okay. Too rich for my blood. We need to figure... Oh, I was just about to leave and I saw this. Something on the floor. Fly fragments. Oh, man. You know what this is? Yeah, it's Wally Fragment. It says it right there. No, but like, this is a mechanic where you're going to see one, and I'm going to see one in editing, and we're going to simultaneously go, Ah, oh, you nincompoop, get it, it's right there. So, But, uh, yeah. So, not... Yeah, yet again, money is an issue. But I know a place where you can have a good time for not a lot of moolah. And that's the shrine. Dang. Looks pretty nice. I don't know. I dig it. And what do you know? This is, a. Uh, is this really another one? No, oh, it's a sign. The sign describes the deity worship to the shrine and the history of the sacred tree. There's something on the ground. Oh, it was that. Okay, so you just get rewarded for also interacting with the environment. That's a good feature. So hello there, sir. Hi. My, my, you look like a pleasant youngin. Aw, oh, thanks. What are you doing at a shrine, though? You don't look like the prayful type. Hey, I'm trying to work on it. This is where I do that, right? Me, well, I've come a long way to pray to the god here. He's a strong one. Yeah, uh, offertory box and the written fortunes both bring great blessings. And there's an Ari sign by the red gates. Whew! Some crazy things might happen if you pray to him. What's that about? You have to pray for a long time. It's no problem for me, but some people might be too busy. I assume that just eats up a whole day. What does that do? I. Hmm? All right. Anyway, we're just going to settle for the normal prayer. And you know what? This is like praying for a good project. We're going to have it. We're going to show off all the content. I'm definitely not going to goof up like last time. Let's spend all 1,000 yen. I was investing in yourself, right? Put money into the box. Hopefully my karmic outlook is looking decent. After making an offering and praying, because I've been blessed with greater intelligence. <laughs> now I can do long division! That's impressive, right? I mean, I, I, I can't. I, it's getting late. Just head back to the room. And honestly, a pretty eventful day. And I'm trying to like. Oh. Welcome back. Did I do something wrong? Perfect timing. I'd like to speak with you for a moment. I did something wrong. Regarding our exploration of Tartarus, Akiko's still on the mat. So for now, I'd like you to lend the, lead the team in combat. Let's see. You never know how, when a powerful enemy might appear, like the one you faced the other day. It's best to be prepared. Helps you may find yourself in a difficult situation. So whenever you'd like to explore Tartarus, just let me know. And I'll gather everyone there. Right on. Also, like, are those, like, shoes, like, you know... Do we have a dress code? Like, you are pretty tall. Anyway, pretty tall is what I'm trying to say. So we can either find Mitsuru or... Summon everybody with the bulletin board, which is a really good feature. Oh, right. Because before I'd be like, oh, Mitsuru's gone, we can't go to... No, he's just, she just moves around a lot like a normal person would. Since I'm sure there are other things you need to take care of, you have permission to go out at night if you need to. Well, that's all for now. Keep up the good work. Thanks. I mean, you know, I'm trying my best out here, but yeah, some businesses offer nighttime exclusives part-time jobs. Then we get a part-time job at night? That's definitely new. We'll check that out in a second. So, Tartarus tonight, pretty much not happening. I don't think that's beneficial. Now, I'm trying not to meta... Oh, he's here too, but, uh, I'm trying not to metagame too much, but the general plan is, like, you've really got to work on your social stats because it genuinely does help you in the long run by just, you know, balancing the life of the tower and, you know, outside. By the way, Officer Kurosawa can't experience the dark hour. He's just an ordinary policeman. He knows what we do. At least in a broad sense. Helps out where he can. Huh. Why does he do that, though? Not at all. Well, I don't know. 
how he knows about our situation, but regardless, seems to be simply following his own convictions, doing what he thinks is right. He's a good man. Should be glad to have him on our side. I guess him and Akigo have some history. Uh, is something the matter? Nah, I'm just checking on you. What's up? Oh, right. <laughs> you may go out at night, but please use the appropriate discretion with this privilege. Oh. Kind of <laughs> just talking like a mom. <laughs> you better be back by 12 or I'll... you're in big time. You're in big time trouble, mister. You know that thing we used to summon our personas, the evoker? I was thinking, why's it got to look like a gun? Uh, good point. I mean, you gotta be a little nutty to point a gun at your head and pull the trigger, you know? Eh, whatever. <laughs> I guess it does make it portable, but I guess it really could be anything. Hmm. Tartarus just strains me for some reason. You know the air is thin at the top of a mountain? It kinda feels like that. What about you, Yukiku? Well, I've never been on top of a mountain, but... Yeah, I guess it would be tough on your cardiovascular. Yeah. You too, huh? Guess we'll just have to go slow. Get used to it. Right, right. Yeah, fun fact, that is like a way people train. They just like train on top of a mountain. Not to get all Akihiko on you. Oh! Oh! What is this? Hey. <laughs> Genuine first time hearing new Persona music. Oh, well, it's actually kind of fun to record these reactions, but uh. Yeah, let's check out the strip mall. We've never been able to do this. So fun fact, you could only go to the mall. It was really annoying and the loading screen took forever. Wasn't a fan. This is a brand new, like, part of the game. So let's just browse a little. Oh, oh my god. I wonder if they're still here. There's a rare frost variant that's only in this game. Did you know that? And it's... <laughs> I, don't, I don't have a name for it, but it's an alien frost. Uh, I don't know. Kind of cool that they uh, kept that into... I mean, why not? Why, why fix it? You know, perfection. Let's try and get a bowl. It's only 350? Yeah, we can afford that. Ooh, mushy beef bowls. Too crowded! God! Sorry, we're full right now. You could do takeout, but that service is only available to our members. You can register to become a member online by using the code, not a fan book. You have a fan book. <laughs> I mean, I guess it could be a recipe book. Please sign up if you'd like. You can buy the fan book at uh, the Net Cafe. Alright. Doing a little bit of reconnaissance yet again, so. This is a sweet shop, but right next to it is ramen. 900 yen. The collagen will make your skin beautiful. A, a pork ramen bowl. I mean, if we can swing it. I don't know if this is like optimal, but. Yeah. Let's, let's you know, just pick out a little bit on some pig. <laughs> Do we actually get to go inside? A frequent customer seems to have enough. Encouraged to order the special hog curry bowl from the burly owner. Looks like it's part of the special menu on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday. Maybe I could do it, order it if I had enough courage. At least it was determined. Okay, so these are new mechanics. Wow, seeing this place. Like, heads up, you spent a lot of time in this <laughs> part of the game. Our today show you ramen with pork. And honestly, all the salt and meat, it's making my skin glow. Don't know how that works, but I'm not gonna question it. Eh. Oh, that was two. Oh, that's two points. Cause you heard the ding ding. Like, yeah, yeah. Okay. Dang. There's a lot to consider in this one. But you know what? We'll, we'll take it one step at a time. Yuki, you by yourself today? Uh, I mean, walking. Yeah, but. Dude, was the room about you and Takabasan coming to school together even true? Uh, well, she's not here today. That's that's for sure. So, you do the you do the math. Uh, yeah. Well, it's not like I care or anything. Anyway, must be pretty unlucky to have transferred here. You seriously don't know? Weird stuff's been happening in this school. There are a couple of folks who say they heard strange voices. I guess since you're always wearing those headphones, you probably not heard anything. Yeah. Oh, I guess I, <laughs> that's cool. That's a little bit of flavor dialogue. You just. You know, I guess he wears them all the time, like, walking class to class. Actually, they don't do Yo, that. Yo, what's up? They, you just stay in one classroom. But. Yo. Hey, man. I'm gonna get some ramen after school. You wanna come? Oh, right. These are voiced. Yeah. Ramen? Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to work on my charm, you know. But why me? Uh, no reason, really. <laughs> just don't have anything to do later. Plus, I figured we could finish our chat from this morning. So how about it, man? Let's get some ramen at the mall and talk. Like... Gossiping? 
I'm going to hang out with my classmate after school. Corny Igor. This will make my persona stronger. Somehow, I decide to go with him. <laughs> He's a bit of a strange. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Uh, um. All right, then. I'm not used to this. Yeah, now, that's what I'm talking about. Well, was I right or was I right? The soup here tastes great, doesn't it? We've got to put some special ingredient in it. Something no other ramen shop would ever use. Maybe there's a secret clue in the shop's name. Ah, my bad. <laughs> He's just kind of talking to himself. <laughs> Creating his own ramen-themed conspiracy theory. I always geek out a little whenever I eat here. Uh, yeah. Well, it's good you're passionate about what you like. Consider the opposite. You do? Really? You taste the magic too? Ah. Man, I wasn't expecting that. I think I'm liking you more by the minute. Oh, goodness. I thought this was about Yukari, so... Huh. By the way, I hear you and oh. Takeba-san are pretty close. There it is. He does not seem like the guy to forget. <laughs> Damn. You just transferred here, too. Well, I can't blame you. Man's got to be aggressive in this day and age. What? Hey, let's hang out after school again sometime. Let me know when you're free. I'll tell you all about my secret plan. Dude, uh, you're gonna flip when you hear it. Oh. I... I am concerned. Kenji Tomochika seems to have taken a liking to me. Because I also like a very popular Japanese meal. <laughs> a voice is ringing in my head. What did I eat? Oh my god, this ramen! I'm starting to see cards! <gasps> I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the magician arcana. And it begins. The magician. Who, uh, yeah, it's a pretty powerful social link. Definitely recommend talking to Kenji, even if you might not be your favorite character, for reasons we'll see in the near future, I guess. Not too far, I guess. Anyway, yeah, do social links. Level up your personas when you've used them. That's pretty much it. What? It's already dark? Damn, I missed my favorite show. Is it that, uh, Lonely Ronin? Heard about that one. Man, for real? Oh, well. well let's get going. <laughs> Seems so bummed. Hey, you made a new uh, friend. First, let's swap numbers. Bust out that cell phone. He is assertive. All right. Oh, we can get invites like this. Yeah. Fair enough. Fair natural. Also, Makoto's phone. Cool. I always wanted one like that. I had a brick, honestly. <laughs> Got the job done though. Played lots of snake in my day. Oh, you. Welcome back. By the way, regarding the dark hour. This may go without saying, but it is impossible to do business at any store during that time. Just make sure you're ready in advance. You don't want to be caught unprepared when it's too late. That is true. Yeah, I don't know if the game auto saves or anything, but this is definitely a franchise we have to save often. So <sighs> let's think about it. We have 200 yen. We are not getting any like food tonight. Oh, I shouldn't phrase it like that. But you know what I mean. So let's instead. See what we can do in our room. And I already know the answer. It's study. <laughs> it's not the most exciting thing, but for a while, it's pretty much the most optimal way to play. I'm gonna spend my time studying. And I feel smarter after working on some difficult problems without giving up. Yes! Mitsuru speech! Perseverance! Eyes and vision! One point, though. It's not gonna make the... Oh, we're already drowsy. I think I've studied enough for today. Yeah, just a little bit at a time. It's far more efficient than cramming. I don't ever did that. What about you guys? I mean, <laughs> what are we doing? Talking about school while playing a school game? Get real. I can hear some people gossiping. You know what? Is it just me? Or have there been more weird people around lately? Wow. Like the ones with apathy syndrome? There's some in my neighborhood too. It's seriously creepy. Sometimes I wonder what will happen if I end up like that. And it just depresses me. Maybe we'll be okay if we exercise and improve our stamina. Actually, I heard that the track team started accepting new members. Maybe running will make us stronger. 
Hmm. That could be cool. I... Huh. It's only the track team in this one. I wonder why that is. In past games, you could actually, like, choose, but, you know, it, it didn't make, like, a big difference. It's just, you know, a little bit of flavor. So here's the question. Do we sign up for track team or hang out with Kenji? Oh, I really like that graphic for the social links. Tough call. Honestly, tough call. But considering the game, like, just said, yo, go to track team. Ah, I think I'm going to do that. Since you just transferred here, do you find yourself getting lost inside the school? Yeah, actually. Even though I've <laughs> been in here so long. I don't blame you. Where do you need help getting to? Uh, oh, don't. This is the, the, the student with the glasses they changed. It's kind looking student just shows you around. Nice. But yeah, I need to go to the, the club room. Need the classroom and go down the stairs to the right. Then go through the double doors on your right hand side and straight. Okay, okay. So it's going to teleport you. All right. I'm fine with that. But yeah, we'll find it. I'm sure. Also, we can probably just... I'm always going to be looking out for these Twilight Fragments, bro. How good are... Like, how good are they going to be? Watch them... Watch me spend, like, hours and hours, like... Just, like, scouring the world for them. And it's like, oh, Johnny, you didn't know? They're actually extremely common and not necessary at all. That may also be the case. So, you know what? I, uh... I'll try my best to uh, be reserved. The sign of the door home economics room looks like it was written in another language. It's hard to read. It doesn't look like English. And if you listen closely, you can hear a mysterious voice inside. How many ghosts are in this goddamn school? I can't bring myself to go in. Well, let me check this out. Home ec. No, that's science. Home ec. Yeah. Let's see. I can see sewing supplies that are used for the classroom. No sign. Oh, here's the sign. Yeah. And there's a club name. Then a mix of Japanese and another language. I can't read it. If only my academics improved. So yeah, this is the first, like... I shouldn't say the first, but one of the earliest instances of... Get your steps up and you can't play the whole game, Dolphus! Let's check out here real quick. Should be the room, right? Oh, whatever. We can actually... Go oh my God, I'm freaking out. I do, I do wonder if they will add some areas, though. As time goes on. That'd be kind of cool. Check out them trees. Dang. Kind of reminds me of those Pokemon trees we will not talk of anymore. Uh, let's move on. <laughs> it's just kind of funny. Huh? People get so upset over like one texture here or there. And I'm just like, man, you're kind of missing the hills for the trees, I guess. Or is it the other way around? I don't know. I'm terrible with proverbs and idioms. The door leads outside of the practice field. It's being used for the track team right now. There's one that says track team now recruiting. No slow pokes. Well, we know one thing about Makoto Yuki. He can sprint. Let's join. No doubt in my mind. This is the place for me. Aren't you from Miss Toriyumi's class? Oh, you want to join the team? I'll take care of the paperwork. So go ahead and introduce yourself to the teammates. All right. Everyone, gather around. So, starting today, he's an official member of the team. Hello. Welcome aboard. I'm Yuko Nishiwaki. She's our team manager. She'll answer any of your questions. You're a second year, right? Since we're in the same grade, you can just call me Yuko. Let's see. Hey, Miyamoto. Yes. This here's our future team captain. A great runner and places well in competitions. You two are in the same class, right? Miyamoto, keep an eye on the new guy here, okay? You got it. You're the guy who went out with Takeba on the first day of school, right? You're practically a celebrity. We did not go out, dude. We were shoulder length apart. <laughs> I'm Kazushi Miyamoto. You've seen me around, right? Then, long story short, from now on, you're mine after school. You better not think you're getting the easy treatment just because you joined mid-season. I sense a budding rivalry. Mimoto's words gave me a warm welcome. I joined the track team and made friends with my new teammates. Nice. And what do you know? Two social leagues in the same episode! Who could have ever predicted this? Oh, me! I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. 
Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the chariot archive. Check out them sphinxes. Uh, like, European style knight. Never really thought about that. That's kind of a weird combo, but it works. Since this is your first practice, just have a look around and then call it a day. Latte. We have practice on Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. There's no practice the days before tests, though. I'll make sure your uniform is ready for next time. Thanks a bunch. She seems on top of things. Or looking around, decided to go back to the dorm. And what do you. Yo. Oh! Hi there. <laughs> so it's kind of a funny thing. <laughs> One time I did a playthrough just to like, you know, rush through the game and every time you go to track, you can just ignore her and she will keep popping up like this. Of course I'm not gonna do that, but the fact they let you is very silly. But hi there. Keep bumping into each other. Oh, hello, what's up? Nothing much, wanna walk on together? And? Actually, no, I'm in a hurry today. Hey, no problem, no problem. See ya. Always try again next time. You can went home alone. And so did I from the sounds of things. Now do we go to Tartarus? I don't know. Do I check my old playthrough to like... No, no, no. I, I kind of want to do this time without a guide. Like a genuine just attempt at a new Persona game. New-ish, right? What's up, dude? Oh, so you're buddies with Tomachika now, huh? He was saying you're someone to watch out for. Uh, oh, but in a good way. How can that be in a good way? Oh yeah, I saw him with you at the uh, strip mall. I mean, we're not super close or nothing. We've known each other for a little while. He's kind of a ladies man. He's a good guy. <laughs> I almost forgot. I can ask if you want to go to Tartarus tonight. Looks like there's uh, more of those lost. You gotta take out more shadows, right? True. True. So let's pray the let's, you know let's let's think about the pros and the cons. One, going to Tartarus will give us more money, which we're severely lacking in. Two, we have to do it, or you know you can't effing play the game. The heck is all this about chores? Huh. Anyway, yeah, we're going tonight. Uh, I guess I just talked to everybody for it. The bro, don't weapons and armor cost too much? Yeah, I guess quality matters. That's kind of make me feel stronger. No, we can't be stingy when it comes to equipment, but man, my wallet's killing me. Yeah, I'm with you there. So... Karijo Senpai is so stoic, isn't she? And she has a lot of responsibilities, so maybe it comes with a territory. She can definitely hear you, you garbage. You're so than earshot. The doctor told me to rest. I don't want to risk losing my edge. I get that. I was thinking that getting back into training could be a good way to rehabilitate, but Mitsuru finds out. Being told to rest would be the least of my worries. Oh, she might uh, hurt you a little more. Something the matter? Yep, we're going tonight. Yes. Very well. We'll meet at Tartarus around midnight. Don't be late. I'll let the others know. Everyone, we're going to Tartarus. <laughs> I get that's like filler uh, dialogue in case they're not all around her. But, you know. As we explore Tartarus, this will be our temporary base of operations. I'm counting on you to take charge during the operation. You got it. So yeah, tactics menu. We're not using any of that. Direct commands, especially once you know what you're doing, are far preferred. It can be helpful if you're like trying to grind up real quick though, but let's quit stowing and get in there. That reminds me. Let's discuss our first goal for this exploration. According to our research, Tartarus is divided into several different regions. If we continue to climb the tower, then we'll eventually reach a spot that leads to a new area. Reaching that spot should be our first All goal. Right. Are you ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Remember, don't push yourself too hard. You can always use the teleporters to return. You can always go back to the highest floor once you've reached that day. Ooh, we can? Here. Take this. If you ever find yourself in danger, don't hesitate to use them. She just gave me... Oh. She's getting... I didn't even need to buy healing. Oh, I already messed up. That's all, my end. Good luck. It'll be fine. But no, we are... We have a lot of objectives, not just to reach the top of this block, but we gotta do some fun raising and also some other stuff. Each floor's dimensions may vary, but don't feel compelled to explore every inch of the new layout. Rushing directly to stairs is completely viable. I leave that choice to your discretion. All right, so now I get to uh, kind of just go on my nerd rant. 
we're gonna have to optimize this run. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do everything I can to get stronger here. But, what did that do? I guess it made me feel cool. Oh no, okay, really drops items. Yeah. Oh, already saw us. Crap, crap, crap. Oh, serpentine! You didn't see that coming! Oh no, we totally did. We didn't get the. You can tell immediately when the enemy skill. sees you or not because of the new music. Okay. So, affinity. What is up with this? I don't get that, but cool. Let's uh just start slashing. Try and learn some weaknesses. If we knock them all down, we get a. Uh, the other thing we're in here for are Persona cards. So I, yet again, don't know if it's still a mechanic. Probably will be, given past games. <laughs> but we need matching Personas. So while this power slash seems really beneficial, trust me, you want new Personas all the time. <laughs> Dude, is killing me. I don't even know why. I just, I mean, I always kind of liked him, but now I'm excited where his character will go. And, dang, can you see down that? You can't see that. Why'd they even bother rendering that? That's bananas. But yeah, for most of the gameplay sections, I'm not going to lie to y'all. There's not a, like, there's not a ton to discuss. So I'm trying to like abridge things when I can. You'll likely find a plethora of strange mineral deposits scattered through Tartarus. Supposedly these formations are crystallized remains of shadows. We're picking up shadow poop? Ugh. Well, remains can mean a lot of things. There's sure to be useful materials inside. <laughs> when you find one, try cracking it open. Okay. So maybe that's also how we get those twilight fragments. Could be. So I'm going to try it. Dang it. They are way more alert in this version. My usual tactics are not going to fly. So do we use SP here? <sighs> how did Junpei lose health? I didn't use power slash at all. Weird. I think I'll just let him go for a normal attack and... Oh! Good stuff. These animations are actually gorgeous, though. I'm flipping out. I already know what these ones are weak to. Yeah, this is fine. I'm really trying to get every bit of EXP and money as possible. But I also get those matching Persona cards. Getting one for the Magician. Shouldn't be too tough. And the Chariot are our short-term goals. The issue is... They won't... I don't think they will appear unless we are a sufficient level. Don't, like, don't like quote me on that, but I could be wrong. So we're going to try and go for shuffle time every time. And, oh, I guess if we get duplicate cards, we get a little bonus EXP. That's rad. I don't know if we should, like, leave and maybe do some fusion. But, yeah, sorry to say, this happens every playthrough. But we're not going to be hanging on to Orpheus forever. I'm sorry, that's, just, that's, just what, that's just the name of that game. I don't, I don't think the game will. But. Yeah, we have Angel of... Uh, Judeo Christianity. I can do a lore on every single little persona. But if there are some new ones, which I haven't even thought about. If only Shadow showed up during class, then I'd have a legit reason to skip. <laughs> Could you please stop thinking nonsense and focus on the upcoming battle? Dang, who's doing the commentary here, y'all? <laughs> anyway, I'll try and like keep that uh, banter intact, and maybe use like party members I wouldn't normally use. That's something like I, yet again. I'm trying to be very ambitious with this one. So I'm going to say a bunch of stuff. I don't know how many stuff I'm going to be execute, like be able to execute on, but I would love to just show off everybody equally. But kind of stuff. The charter is changing nature. The records become useless the next time you visit. Oh, minimap and shortcuts. Wait, what? Oh, I get what this is. All right, so if you find the stairs immediately, you can still explore this. The, you can explore the whole floor and then just warp straight to the stairs, I think. I think that's how it works. And if that is, if that is the case, that is a huge time saver. Because I was thinking, right? Like, all right. It's been how many years since the original P3? What are they cooking, you know? Like, back in the day, right, when this was most likely conceptualized, the concept of a roguelike was a brand newish thing. And, you know, that formula has been adapted over the years and really transformed. So they bring any of that into reload? Fingers crossed. We will find out though. And yeah, I'm not getting new personas. It's kind of concerning. Hmm. Can we slow down for a sec? 
No, we cannot. Uh, hey, don't leave me behind. Jesus. All right, looks like this floor is all taken care of. There are a couple close uh, calls, but we're still moderately healthy. <laughs> no. Careful. No, not the birds. Not the birds. I'm detecting a powerful enemy up ahead. Everyone, stay sharp and don't start crying. Judging by the frequency of the signal, this is undoubtedly a stronger foe. It'd be a wise decision to regroup before approaching. Yeah, you don't tell Shoot. I'm out of here. That device. We may be able to use it. Check it out. It also may electrocute you and you'll die. But, you know, I mean, better you than me. The console is displaying a series of numbers. I see. Go ahead and select the first floor in that device. I'll tell you. Ooh. I didn't realize Tartarus was so granite -y. That means we have new artwork for the tower. Oh my god. I knew it. Those devices are teleporters. They're portals that are all connected to one another. Once activated, you should be able to travel between any of the other devices. Be sure to activate any you come across. They'll be quite useful during future expeditions. Dang, she's figuring this out too. It should, in theory, work. Like she doesn't know. I guess she technically doesn't. I mean, every theory starts with, you know, <laughs> a hypothesis, but... Yeah, so we're a little beat up, and usually this clock, or at least in the... Oh, it does! The clock at the entrance can be used to fully restore HP and SP for your entire team. You find clocks on floors you're currently exploring. What? Activating a clock requires seven Twilight Fragments. Oh, okay. So we got an economy, huh? All right, all right. Okay, so to prepare for the birds, uh, I'm gonna grind. Oh, what do we got here? Major Arcana cards. Okay. So this is a totally new mechanic then. Okay, yeah. So, game's just saying straight up, now Major Arcana cards can show up in shuffle time, and if you get a if you get an Arcana burst, which I guess just, you know, in this case, if we get two Major Arcana cards, the ranks of all of the Minor Arcana go up. So you know I'm taking that. And this is a perfect one to get increases... Uh, just EXP gain from battles until we leave. Yo, that's that's like all we could ask for. That just showed up while I was grinding. Not bad. Okay, I did a quick little run through, and other than finding that major arcana card, there wasn't a whole lot going on, so I will be abridging things for the sake of your convenience. But we're all level 5, and Yukari and Junpei learn some new skills. So let's just check those out real quick. We got Patra and Agi on Hermes. All around, not a lot of action, but before we head back into Tartarus and fight that <laughs> mini boss, which I'm genuinely kind of afraid of, let's uh, make sure to full heal. I did not get any new fragments, but I think this is well worth it to just ensure our success and longevity in here. Hmm, it's quite the interesting animation. I wonder what's up with that. And finally get to what is actually keeping me to these Persona games for so long, and that's the fusion system, baby! I love it, love it, love it, love it! Still do. Welcome to the Velvet Room. I have been anticipating your arrival. The time has come for you to wield your power. My role is to create new Personas. By merging multiple Persona cards together, they can be reborn into a new form. One could call it a fusion of personas. There is much hidden potential within your persona abilities. We've never had a guest show this much promise in the past. Never? Huh. Indeed. And by establishing social links, you may be able to create even stronger personas as well. Oh, ho! This shall prove to be most interesting. To that end, as you accumulate cards, please bring them to me. If you wish to learn more about fusing personas in greater detail, then come talk to me so that I may give you some hints. I will assist you to the best of my ability. I believe it. So, let's get fusing. So pretty much, this is how you acquire the best personas possible. The ones in battle are fine, but they're sort of just the stepping stones to greater power. And yeah, I freaking love Persona. I love fusing. I could talk about it forever, but I'll save you the details. Oh. Oh. 
that was cool. Okay, sorry. <laughs> so right off the bat, we do have the Persona Compendium. And I'm so tempted. You have no idea to see which Personas were added, which ones were not. However, there's the possibility we have new Personas in this one. So... I don't want to do that, but I'm really curious. But yeah, let's just register everybody. I was looking for it. That just saves the EXP that we have on them. Now let's get a fusion. I'm curious if the classic fusion has changed at all. We don't want to get rid of Angel, because she's actually pretty strong for us right now. We'll get Pixie, which we acquired from inside of Tartarus, and Apsaris to make the classic OG cat girl. Nekomata. <laughs> she really is the OG cat girl. Think about that. And yeah, you can check out their lore and everything. If you so desire, but... <laughs> I don't need that! I have it all obviously memorized. But thanks to Kenji's social link advancing, we get a EXP boost when fusing this persona. So she won't be level 3. She'll actually get a level up, which is pretty nice. In the ideal situation. It's hard it to say, but... It seems you have been blessed with some power. Yes, I have. Let's uh, pass on the Bufu skill so we can, you know, deal multiple Why, different kinds of damage. Exciting. And I've never it's seen this, so I'm freaking out. The cars look so beautiful in this one. And it's a really, like, it's not like a fancy effect, but it's really effective, I guess. Oh. No, summoning circle. Woo! All right, then. The image of a cat woman has been imprinted in your brain. I'm Nekomata. I'm getting up in years. I'll do my best to take care of you from now on. Oh, how fitting. We use Kenji <laughs> to fuse it. Uh, more on that later. Let's, uh, yeah, get Power Slash. Also a decent skill. And all around her stats are pretty basic, you know. Nothing too crazy starting out. But with the power of the cat, we should be able to deal with those strong shadows. Up on the fifth floor. At least I hope so. Shoot, I don't know how hard mode is. They might one-shot me. I mean, that happens. <sighs> Something about Tartarus and birds. I don't know. It's just... you think the birds all cooped up in here wouldn't be very strong, but I swear, they're the most powerful arc... You keep saying that word. I don't... Anyway, I guess it's like French or something? I gotta look it up now. Thanks a lot, Mitsuru. It's gonna be bugging me. Here we go. We're full healed. We got a new persona equipped. I'm not sure if it's actually equipped. There we go. And now we start the fight. It's enemy territory up ahead. Are you ready for battle? I better be. Goodness. It's been a minute grinding. Well, it's only two. It's not a trio. If you're not going to move, then we'll make you. Oh, because they're blocking the way. Oh, don't. This is beyond the level of an ordinary shadow. Watch yourself. Y'all can't see me, but... Dance, white boy, dance! Okay, let's uh, let's focus. Ruthless Ice Raven. So there's an unwritten rule in the SMT games and Persona that fire and ice beat each other, wind and electricity beat each other, and light and dark beat each other. However, that rule is sometimes bullcrap and they change it. So YOLO! I think she just popped out. Hey, all right, it worked! It worked! I was overthinking, bro. Nekomata's got our back here. She should be at least decently stronger than Orpheus. I'm gonna feel like an absolute idiot if she's worse. But no, we need her for something later, so just throwing that out there. Easy all out attack, and we. Uh oh. Isn't Nekomata. No, she's not weak. Oh, yeah, she's weak to uh, electricity. This is all of her fur. This. Dude, this game rock. I'm sorry. I was excited, but. She's getting new remixes. So far, I like every single one, I'll be honest. Like, I was worried about that. Your is a bit low. We'll be alright. This should finish him off. Hopefully. So damage output is an issue. But I also don't know if Yukari has her best, like, equipment possible right now. Probably at the end of the episode, I'll, I'll just do a bit more preparing. You know how it is. And down they go. Nice. I was majorly overthinking. It's the first mini-boss, bro. They can't do that to us, right? Okay, so now we can fuse Personas of level 6, which is pretty handy. I don't know if I mentioned that while we are in the Velvet Room, but yeah. Nicely done. Well done, everyone. That was a formidable opponent. Yeah. Okay, my stunning performance aside, are all of us totally on the same wavelength now? I get that. Let's not bring up your stunning performance ever. And I'd rather not be on the same wavelengths as you ever. Uh oh <laughs> Why not? Teamwork makes the dream work, right? 
Jeez. They made Shrek! Well, I guess you have a point. That is a classic. Let's keep up the good work. Yeah, all right, high fives all around. We're doing good work for a new team. Let's keep up the pace. Right now, Tartarus is our only lead into unraveling the mystery behind the Dark Hour. All righty, let's just keep on moving. We will do just that. In the next episode of Persona 3 Reload, <laughs> aren't I a stinker? But straight up, I'm having a blast with this game. We established two new social links. And uh, we got two bowls of ramen. That's. <laughs> it sounds like we did a lot more than that, but that's kind of about it. As always, though, thank you so very much for the support. And yeah, next time we ascend even higher. See you then. Bye.